Welcome guys to Small Life is Strange. My knees have all still. Welcome just to Life is Strange episode 3. I found the code. Four. Max the hacker strikes again. Whoa. Spoiler alert. Rachel definitely hooked up with Frank. But why does David care? Instead of stalking Kate, David could have helped her. This is so wrong. Oh, creepy bastard. This is 2013 to 2014. Wow. I better tell Chloe about this now. It's just one more thing to make her sad and mad. <coughs> No need to go there now. See so how how you see leave Chloe's home. You can't do that. And if you wanted to go upstairs, you couldn't do that. Oh shit. Nice breakfast. David, you you back already? I have to take a nap after writing up vandalism reports last night. What happened? Some little shit ass punks broke into the swimming pool. This is what happens at these PC bullshit colleges. Entitled students taking over the campus. Do you know for sure it was Blackwell students? Who else would do it? And I'm gonna bust them. Figures you'd be here. Is that your Rachel Amber Halloween costume? You know more about her than me. No, you and Chloe think you know more than anybody, like all teenagers. Leave Max alone, David. Stop threatening students. He threatens them with surveillance cameras so he can spy on everybody, like he spies on all of us here. Don't start, Chloe. Not now. Yeah, I'm just always starting shit, right? You're a total paranoid, David. Not now, Chloe. He used to call me a loser for getting kicked out of Blackwell. So who's the loser now, David? Who haven't you accused or harassed? Between your investigations into Rachel and Kate, what have you done besides get in trouble? I'm sorry, but Chloe's gonna die one day. I have to. You're a bully, David. I saw you harass Kate Marsh when she was going through hell. You could have totally helped her. Everybody at Blackwell is a suspect to you, except for Nathan Prescott. That's why the students and faculty don't like you. You even threatened me. I do respect your service, but you don't respect anybody. Uh, you were smoking pot in Chloe's room. That's illegal. So is spying on people in your family. Max Wilson. Work. Why do you have photos of Kate Marsh and Rachel Amber in your files anyway? What? Is this true, Max? Yes, David. Why do you have these files at all? I find this very disturbing. Oh, I love these actors. I do not have to take this kind of interrogation. Not from you punks. Maybe you should calm down. Oh, you're turning on me now, huh? Of course. Women always stick together. Well, screw you. David, you better go to a hotel until we figure this out. You can't kick me out of my own home. It's my home, David. Paid for and in my name. You know the law, right? Why, oh, I, I thought I knew a lot of things. Like when I'm out flanked. Have a nice day, Chloe. For once, just please shut up. I hope Joyce doesn't hate me for tearing into David. Max, that gave me chills. And you better not remind this one. Okay, fine. Let's leave. I'll be nice today. 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 How are we like that? Listen, when I went through David's laptop, I found pictures of Rachel and Frank being 
more than friends. <laughs> right, no way, Max. She was just posing to tease Frank. If you're not going to believe me, why don't we check out what Frank has in his RV? What's that going to prove? Frank has Rachel's bracelet. What else does he have in there? Motherfucker better not have anything for his sake. Let's check the door. Frank gets so wasted, he sometimes forgets to lock it. I can't believe you hung out with him. Not anymore. We have to be casual ninjas here. Shitballs. Okay, here's the plan. I'll go to the diner and distract Frank by telling him I have his money, but he needs to come with me. Then you come in and rewind so Frank doesn't see me. Then you can tell Frank he needs to check out his RV, and then you rewind after you get the key, and, uh, and... Chloe, I got this. I'll be right back. Don't let my epic plan get in the way of yours. I'll try to scrounge up a Scooby snack to distract his mangy mutt. Now to find a quick and easy way to snag Frank's keys. What the hell is this? Oh, I hope she finds a nice T-bone to keep the doggy busy. Happy birthday. Have a very special 18th birthday. You're an adult now, but you're still a little girl. Check your account. Don't blow it. It's all that once. Maxi, pop here. I'm sorry I haven't got in touch sooner. I know you're upset, but the moment that I knew you did everything you could to save that girl, some things are just out of control. And if you want to come back to relax and maybe go to high school and the door is wide open. Oh. What's she saying? No, now? I don't want to go there. Nope, I don't want to go there. This is so creepy. Look at all these flyers. It's so sad that nobody will read them. Good morning. How are the fish today? Don't ask. First the snow, then an eclipse. What's next? A tornado? I hope not. Could be worse. We could get one of those California quakes. True. Well, I'm feeling a little dizzy now. Hope you catch the big one today. I better. Too late to switch careers now. See you around, kid. That would be cool to be a trucker for a while. Always on the road. I hate seeing old women on the street like that. <sighs> nice world. Hmm. Look at that. So sad and disturbing and beautiful at once. What an amazing shot. So ominous. Yes, another great day in Arcadia Bay. Good Lord, bacon. I'm ready to nosh again. Oh, but I need to get those keys from Frank. Nathan has time to get drugs from Frank because he was expelled. Can't drop any tunes right now. Keys. <laughs> Forgot 
forgot about the fishing wall of fame. <sighs> Looks tasty, but my need for keys comes first. Never mind me, officer. I'm just here to steal a drug dealer's keys. You have serious balls, little girl. But hanging out with Chloe, playing with guns, and dressing up like Rachel doesn't make you cool or tough. What the fuck do you want? Take a picture of me and I'll break your fucking camera. How do you know these are Rachel's clothes? Because she looks beautiful in them and you look like ass. You're lucky I just took that gun from you. Grab your keys and let's check out your RV. Let's not. You fucking creep me out. Wait, eh? In other words, Max, no keys. Maybe I could chat up that officer, or even Nathan, and then go all Groundhog Day on them until I get the info I need. Are we serious? They want to. How you doing, Maxine? I'm so sorry you had to be up there with Kate when she, you know, just know that we're proud of you for going up there. Thanks, Officer Barry. I know you guys deal with this stuff way more than me, but it is hard to deal with. I'm glad you're representing Black Bull Academy. I thought Nathan Prescott represents Blackwell. Well, don't make me backwash this bacon. You know what the Prescotts represent. Taking over Arcadia Bay? You're not far wrong, Max. I heard the Prescotts were working on some new big land deals. Mr. Prescott helped out my family once a while ago, so I made a deal with him that I can't seem to get out of. Man, if I could get one instant replay in life. I better finish my breakfast first. How you doing? Thanks, sir. I'm glad. I feel like David Madsen represents Blackwell. Not for long. He's a loose cannon. We all respect him for his service, but he's too eager. He's eager to be a dick to me and Chloe. That's true. He was ranting about a stolen gun, then I tuned out. Somebody's always out to get him. Try interrogating somebody else, Lieutenant Caulfield. You can use this camera. Turn up the brain to 11, Max. How can you snag Frank's keys? What the fuck now? David Madsen is looking for that gun. He might show up on your RV step. Oh, I'm trembling. I don't need to take his little museum piece. Could I get you to drop Chloe's death? Are you supposed to be a smart student? You'll find out if you do me this favor. Thanks, Godmother, but I don't need your favors. And Chloe doesn't get any from me. outfit. <laughs> By the way, thanks for getting me fucking expelled, you tweet bitch. You're lucky this is a public place. Considering we're in a public diner with a police officer right over there, you shouldn't advertise your rage, Prescott. Oh yeah? You shouldn't have bitch snitched on me to that fucked up principal. Listen, Nathan. I'll take back everything I said about you, if you hook me up with Frank. Know what I mean? You look like you've never even taken a hit of baby aspirin. How do you think I stay wired all night studying? So is it a deal or not? 
Calm down, hard up. Deal. You'll get your school supplies. Just go over to Frank and whisper, higher education. You'll hook your ass up. But can I tell you something? That's not gonna work. Chloe's photo. What the fuck now? See, it just, it won't work. Fine. By the way, Frank, I was wondering if you had any, um, higher education. <laughs> oh yeah, sure. Do you want the after-school special to go with that? Jesus. Look, I don't sell anything but bottles to feed me and my dog. I work for a living. Not like you spoiled Blackwell punks with too much time on your hands. But... But nothing. Don't ever ask me for anything ever again. Ever. And I'll back off. What can I do for you, Max? Well, I heard a rumor you were working for the Prescott family on the side. Jesus, doesn't this town ever shut up? I don't blame you for getting extra work. Look, sometimes I check up on the Prescott family to make sure they're doing all right. Nathan included. Keep this quiet, Max. Turn up the brain to 11, Max. How can you snag Frank's keys? Buster doesn't mention whacked students with guns. Maybe we all did. Shit. What are the other signs then? I could chuck this beer. Or dump it on Frank. Fear is gross, so... I just wanted to see what would happen if I did this. I'm gonna kill you! I bet Frank hooked you and Rachel Amber up with party supplies. Nice try. Rachel partied like a fiend on her own. More than me. I doubt that. Like you would know, virgin. Even that pig over there knows Rachel hung out more with Frank. I mean, don't talk to the cop about that, dumbass. How you doing, man? Thank you. I'm glad. But look at this. Does that say you? Nathan said that Rachel Amber represents Blackwell. With Frank Bowers. Bowers ain't no student anymore. 
Sadly, he does represent one side of Arcadia Bay. I want you to stay out of his orbit, okay? He man that rabid mutt. I heard something about Frank Bowers and his puppy. My boy does love his dog. Especially when the dog is your personal drooling bodyguard. You can bet he trained that poor thing on blood. Gross. I wouldn't bet. Where did he get the pup? Frank used to bet on dog fights. And to his credit, he had a revelation. He saved a bunch of the dogs, kept one for himself. He's still a creep. You and that Chloe stay away, right? No need to go there now. Jesus Christ, it's the proper. What can I do for Well, Jesus, doesn't it? I don't blame you. Look, son. What can I do for you? Do you think Arcadia Bay is a weird town? I'd take a normal city with normal problems about now. It makes me sick thinking about it. I feel like David Matt. Not from. He's evil. That's true. Oh no. What can I do for you? I guess Kate Marsh will be the face of Blackwell for a while. Such a waste. Awful. Never mind me, officer. I'm just here to steal a drug dealer's keys. Holy shit, what do you want now? <laughs> Probably an idiot. We already have that high case. Uh... I heard your dad hired a local cop to keep an eye out on you and Frank Bowers. Like a babysitter. Bullshit! My dad doesn't hire. He owns. And these pigs know better than to knock on me. Do they? I hope that means Frank won't get busted. Eventually he will. Guys, into some freaky shit. He told me once he took a weird blood oath for Rachel. Uh, forget I told you that. Seriously. Now get off my crack, whore. Keep your pie holes shut. What the fuck now? These people are disrespectful, I've got to say. Oh. <laughs> well, here's something I haven't tried before, and then after that I'm going on the internet. You act so scary, but you did save all those dogs. One, I'm not acting. Two, who told you about the dogs? It's actually a great story. You're an animal lover. Could I pet the doggy? I could go grab him from your RV right now. <laughs> <laughs> I won't even let you pick up the dog shit. Besides, you don't want a leash. You want these keys right here. Look at your eyes dilate. You're worse than a junkie, Max. But no fix for you. You know what we're gonna do? <laughs> I'm afraid I'll have to take your keys now, asshole. You did not just do that. Give me back my keys, bitch. Give me my keys now. He brought. Now back to Chloe. I thought I was gonna have to give up then. <laughs> Good morning. Don't it? Good. True. I better. Alyssa, 
Watch out! Quit thinking, Max. Oh, how many times are we gonna do this? Good morning. True. I bet. Careful, Max. Cujo ahead. Nice Scooby snack, Chloe. I should have known. The amazing Spider Max. I couldn't have done it without Brain. Now let's get in and out. You'll need this, Max. On your mark, get set, throw! Uh, uh, the tree, tree, boy. Uh, 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 I think we just made that dog our bitch. Get it? Now we can snoop in peace, but let's not waste time. The doggy is busy now, but he might come back. Right, so later we can either keep both of them alive or both of them die. Damn, I thought my room was a shithole. You're not a creepy drug dealer. Frank has issues, but he's not creepy. At least I didn't think so until I saw him with Rachel's bracelet. Cruise everywhere in this bad boy. Can you see us heading down the coast of Big Sur and beyond? Yes, we'd be tearing up the highway. And you'd probably want me to kiss you again. Chloe, we're on a schedule. We need clues about Rachel. I know. Just daydreaming. You scope the area while I hack his computer for info. That would be so cool to take this baby on the road. Frank is almost a made-for-TV hoarder. This place is nasty. Chloe isn't scared. She's loving this. Nice Rick. Glad Frank, of course Frank gets the munchies. Is Frank going to deal online now? That's a pretty extreme lighter. Too bad I don't have my Frank Bowers decoder ring. Are these for Frank or is he selling them? Or both? Okay, this vent is loose. I need something to pry it open. That's almost cute to see Frank posing with his dog. Crappy Wi-Fi out here. Must take him days to download a porn. Yuck. Chloe isn't scared. She's loving this. How can somebody live like this?